one that I just love. I don't know why, but I love it. Maybe the colors, the shapes, it resonates with me today. That's why I'm choosing it. Just one. So then I take, I'm not going to do anything with the paper. I'm then going to go through my other papers and think to myself, what other papers would be interesting with this? So I don't want to just keep it these colors. So I've kind of landed up pulling out, let's see, some kind of green paper that's a similar theme of these plant materials that we did on the jelly plate. Now some, now, okay, so now I have two papers that I've pulled out that are, I like these together. I really do. I think the colors, they're almost like complementary colors, which uh, if you don't know, are opposite each other on the color wheel. Now I want to really emphasize that the thing you want to do when you're putting your papers together is to find contrasting papers that would be good with it. So I always talk to <laughs> jelly plate it has no it has a little bit of this texture in it but it's not as as kind of textured and like um richer rich as this is so this is i'm going to pull this out as a contrast to my very textured papers i don't know how i'm going to use it but i'm just pulling it out as a paper to add to my pieces. Now, the other reason I chose this is because it has a darker tone than these, and you want that contrast of tone. So while you guys are choosing your papers, just consider that, the difference of texture versus non-texture, the, the tonal difference, the dark versus the medium versus the light. Um, and I'm going to just pull out another few papers that I think would be interesting with it. I may use them or I may not. So here's another piece that is more of a light. Actually, there's something inside there. That does not work. Do you see how adding all of these textures together is too much. So actually the other side of it is a little more interesting. I may use that. I'm also going to be choosing some black, some plain black paper, because I tend to find that I'm always adding black somewhere or like a very dark version of the, this is not dark enough for me. This feels like it's going into a deeper, darker state. 